So Ali, a difficult result to take last weekend means that your European rugby is now sort of over for the Saints. How does that affect your mindset going into this weekend? Um, in a way, it's sort of affected us pretty positively. Um, we'd, we'd want to pay back our fans, for, especially the ones that travelled out to Cast uh, and over to Munster. And uh, I think we're, we're sort of under pressure now to, to perform and, and get a big win at home and and uh, just get back into winning ways. Um, I know we're out of competition, but we'd still like to uh, keep winning as we go out to win every game. And I think we, we need to start winning and, and uh, get back on the right uh, and get back and start building our momentum again. Looking at how that game went, do you think that maybe it was down to a slightly different approach from you guys? Were you, were you going out there um, maybe with a bit of pressure that you had to win? or? Um, I think we were always under pressure and obviously Cast is a good team, they haven't lost many games at home um, and uh, I think we were always up against it but in the past we've been pretty good being under pressure, especially being underdogs, we've seen, we tend to perform a lot better and things seem to click and, and uh, it just didn't happen for us on, on the weekend and, and we came out with a, a, a hiding pretty much. Looking at their side, they're such a big physical unit. You're obviously one of the biggest guys in the Saints squad. What's that like as a confrontation on the field? Um, it, it's, it's actually quite easy with the guys uh, around me, with Courtney and, and Samu and, and Doran Jones and Hartley. They, I mean, they weren't much bigger than, than our pack, but, um, but uh, I, think, uh, we, we, I, I think we did all right. It's just the, the little last 50-50s and ball retention that sort of uh, cost us the game. Solid in the set piece and at the scrum. Um, when you're moving into the Heineken Cup, having played in the Premiership, do you have to look at different ways to to, to approach the different referees? Uh, I think we do. Yeah, um, the sort of referees tend to ref, referee different ways, um, and obviously the the pack that we come up against is uh, is not the the usual week to week packs in the Premiership and the, and coming up against the, the French packs. They're, they're normally quite good in their set piece and and they take pride in that. So. We, we, we tend to, we, nothing changes from, from our perspective, we, we tend to try and do the same thing and, and stick together and, and do what we work at our training, but, um, but I think it's a, it comes down to a mental state of mind that we've got to keep doing what we do in the Premiership and, and not change much when we go into the Huntington Cup. And just on a final note, off the field, uh, your testimonial year was launched earlier this week. Does that stir up some, some memories of your career past? And I, I guess it's good to see the reception you get from the fans as well. It has, yeah, it's been brilliant. But um, <clears throat> it's been, brought, it's, it, it brings me back to earth when I come into the training the next morning and all the boys give me a lot of, I can't swear on this, can I? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, when the boys give me a lot of stick for it. But um, yeah, no, just to have the fans, uh, just to be recognised in that kind of way by the fans is, is brilliant. And, like I said the other night, I was just really humble and grateful for being recognised in that way.